Hello people, welcome to one more video here in the channels Tapaulio Azul and Super Academico. And today I'm going to continue with the series of videos with pitches of stories né, for movies or series uh, based upon my own stories, my own books. Uh, this one is called Arpeggio, Arpeggio, that is in this book that collects all my uh, early works, uh, the works that I wrote in my 20s, my 20s, Arpeggio. So <clears throat> before I begin, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and ring the bell for notifications and keep following these speeches. If you know anyone that can um, reach and produce or uh, develop these projects, please, you are welcome to share this link to the, this video to this kind of people so i can have my stories produced and we have the opportunity to see all these stories comes to life so arpeggio 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 is a word from the the uh, music sound theory that means a repeated repeated sound that compose that mounts that it goes on and on in the, the part of the music like a bum 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 like something like this since i like music very much so i develop a story with this name but of course this story is not about music it's about crime murder mystery <laughs> so imagine uh, a dawn in the tropical city of salvador the city where I live. As the sun comes up, a terrible crime is revealed. A slaughtered body laid under the statue of the Christ, a tourist point in the city just offshore. Imagine that. A beautiful girl is jogging just by this spot and finds the body. Her name is Carol, and an advertisement student that had her brother, a police officer, killed in the line of duty. So, this is the situation. When the police arrives, who is in charge of this case, of this investigation, is the, is the detective Luciano, former partner of Carol's dead brother. So, it's a coincidence, a tragic fail. That you have a birth girl who had a uh, deceased brother who was a cop, a policeman, and his former partner, partner is now a detective that he we will investigate this terrible crime that you don't know yet. Who body is this? Who body this is? Whose body this is? Sorry, my my English. I'm Brazilian. I'm not an uh, English speaking person. Uh, this reunion you know, of Karen and Luciano drives the attraction between them, uh, between the two, but during the tragic circumstance of the investigation. So, you have a relationship between a man and a woman uh, uh, that will begin in this circumstance of the crime investigation. Later on, it's discovered that the body Carol found was a girl named Elena. And she was a college colleague of Carol. Another tragic coincidence, which adds more emotion to the plot. Getting so close, the police get suspicious of another class student, Fernando. He had shown to be falling in love for Elena before and for Carol in a different times and in both cave cases he was not responded so it was uh just a boy né? a young man that had fallen in love for elena the victim and also for carol afterwards but he was not corresponded in both cases being being a sad and weird boy everybody starts to get suspicious of him including the invasive and gossip girl Frida. So you have 
in a college situation uh, four students right Carol Elena Frida and Fernando in a turning point Frida provokes Fernando during a party and he vanishes he vanishes from the party in the same party in a tourist place in Salvador Carol and Luciano are together and Frida meets them so Frida meets them the couple Carol and Luciano in the same party later Carol and Luciano make love in a motel and Frida get attacked, attacked, assaulted in the street. She's not killed, but gets her face nearly destroyed. So he, uh, she is completely uh, violated, not, not sexually, but in a way that she, her face gets really messed up. Fernando is the main suspect, of course, because everybody saw what she did to him in the party. But somehow Carol begins to get close to him, since now he is appealing to her as a dangerous guy. So, strangely, in the same way that she is attra attracted to Luciano, and the, the policeman, the former friend and, and partner of her brother, uh, she begins to feel attracted uh, attracted to Fernando because he, he is now uh, at the spot uh, he got the attention of the, the people because he's a suspect of a crime it seems strange but she follows that path for some time Luciano of course gets jealous and gets then almost naked during a stakeout so there's a stakeout to get Fernando and is in this stakeout uh, Luciano gets them almost together yeah, almost in the act of having intercourse then we have Luciano uh, reporting yeah, the, the incident afterwards saying that Fernando raped and killed Carol and then he got and killed Fernando in a reaction for his outburst of rage with a knife over him. So he claimed that he witnessed, witnessed, saw, sorry, saw Fernando raped and killed, killing, killed Carol. And when he confronted him, he was attacked, so in self-defense, he killed Fernando. Later, after a visit from a sad Elena's brother, uh, his name is Carlos, <coughs> in, in his apartment, uh, Fernando, uh, Luciano's apartment, thanking the, uh, Elena, Elena's brother, thank, thanked him, thanked Luciano for getting his sister uh, murdered, uh, his sister's murderer. Luciano reveals to himself, that's important, like a strange psycho voice in his head, that it was him all the time. So this is the turning point. This is the big reveal. That's the, the murder actually was the policeman, the hero of the story all the time is the murder, murderer. Like a music arpeggio, a sound that repeats itself, he kills and harms ones, the ones that comes against him. He started dating Elena, she dumped him, and he raped and killed her viciously. As we see in the beginning, her body was completely destroyed. One could not identify even if it was a man or woman what happened no face no hands no guts no nothing just that blah, the splash then he felt threatened by frida and assaulted her violently so in this case uh, in this story it shows that in the same night that he and luciano and carol had intercourse in a motel later he followed and attacked frida but of course, for the story, it seems that it was Fernando. 
He lost Carol's love to Fernando and killed him and blamed him for everything. And finally he loved and lost Carol and then he raped and killed her so he could blame Fernando. Now the arpeggio is silent. Yeah, the arpeggio has silenced. Luciano will have to carry that lie to himself forever. Forever? Let's see if there's a possibility of a sequel of that we see that 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 lie will be able to carry forever or not so this was the pitch of the story arpeggio so i hope you liked the story of course there is a spoiler here if you intend to read the reading is in portuguese but it's, it's easily translated uh, but the intention here, of course, is to reach out for the people that can eventually produce a movie or a series about this story. So, that was it for today. I hope you like, enjoy, like the video and subscribe the channel and share so everyone can know these stories and make, maybe produce them someday. Bye-bye.